process is pretty simple. It's basically, um, you know, I've done a ton of cold emailing and it is very effective. Um, but I was really amazed whenever I started doing this LinkedIn prospecting. And, and again, uh, this will vary a bit by industry that you target, but I'm, I've come to the, the consensus that I think some people actually like to be approached through LinkedIn more than through email. Um, I think they're just less on guard or just, I don't know what it is, but I've just been really blown away by some of these results. Um, and so basically what the process is, is really simple. It's first optimizing your LinkedIn profile, getting a really, really good catchy tagline that's going to hook someone's attention who's your target prospect. Um, and then kind of optimizing your profile, making sure that that's looking good, that's looking sharp. Um, and then basically it's two actions to actually drive leads. The first is basically connecting with a hundred of your target prospects per day by just sending a connection request with, you know, a semi-personalized message. Uh, typically it's not like a, a long sales pitch. If you've ever gotten like a super long sales pitch right out of the gate when someone added you on LinkedIn, that can be a turnoff at times, but just something I'm like, Hey, your profile looked interesting. Seems like we both work in the design industry or something like that. Would love to connect. Something just short and sweet and almost like a conversation starter like that. Um, and then when someone accepts that, then basically dripping them a handful of messages over time. And just doing that with 100 per day and then dripping the messages just generates a, a ton of leads and a ton of conversations, um, especially for kind of independent coaches or consultants or stuff like that when you're kind of targeting other small businesses. Um, and then the well, yeah, second sorry, half, oh, go, ahead. Sorry, just, go ahead. Yeah, just, um, just on that, before we maybe jump onto that second half, uh, so vital to get the, the profile right because when you are going to be, you know, connecting with these, um, you know, cold outreach uh, in-mails, if you like, or uh, messaging through, through LinkedIn, uh, they're going to be coming and checking out your profile and, um, you know, you make sure that you are, you do have it sharp as, as Jake said, but um, it has to be really on point for that specific prospect that you're targeting. So when you are targeting people, make sure that they are all fit into the, in the similar type of, um, you know, category of prospects. So then your profile will reflect that and help you, you know, close, close more of the deals too. Yeah. The, that profile optimization goes such a long way and especially that tagline, just with everything you do on that, that tagline is the, the first thing or probably the only thing a lot of people see. So if, that tagline doesn't hook them in, then, you know, then that's like, that's a, a, a deal breaker on LinkedIn. So a good tagline is a, a complete multiplier to your, your, all your LinkedIn efforts. So. Absolutely. Yeah. It follows you everywhere. <laughs> on LinkedIn, so optimize that for sure. Um, and that, the second half of that. Yeah. So the second half of the tactic is, you know, we do the connection requests to go actually start conversations. And the second half of it's really simple. Um, it's something that anyone can really do. There's this plugin called Duck Stoop, um, which basically goes and it'll visit basically up to 500 profiles of your target prospects every day. So you put together a search queue. It goes and it'll visit 500 profiles. It doesn't message them or say anything. 